Now, in computer science, the term syntactic sugar refers to things in a programming language that are designed to make certain things easier to read or express, or even potentially provide an alternative way of doing something um, that some developers or programmers may prefer over the kind of original way that you would do it. So, you know, with that in mind, you can kind of think of syntactic sugar as uh, making a language sweeter for human consumption. Uh, as cheesy as that sounds. Um, examples of uh, syntactic sugar in JavaScript that uh, you may not necessarily think of are things such as map, filter, reduce, which provide syntactic sugar over uh, for loops, uh, as well as things like uh, async await, which provides syntactic sugar over promises. We can refer to things in a programming language as syntactic sugar if it's possible to take them out of the language without impacting on the overall functionality of the language. 